Hey guys, how are you doing? This is my second video I'm filming today. Not sure what order I'm going to post it in, but it is my Smuggler's Bounty solo box. So I'm filming uh, in the natural light today in my living room, which means you get all of the wonderful sounds of nature as well as all of the wonderful sounds of my neighbors driving back and forth and doing things. So we'll just have to deal with that. So this is the solo box. I love that they have Lando on the front here. That is so cool. One of the ones that I wish I had gotten because I started collecting later and he was already sold out and really expensive by the time I could think about getting him. Anyway, uh, I now have two Landos from the new solo movie, so that is awesome. Anyway, let's talk about this box. This is the Funko and Star Wars collab box. It is ending in September. They have not said whether it has gone to retail yet or not, or who will be carrying it in retail. I am paid up through the end of the term for this box, so I will be getting more of them until September. This box is $25 a month plus shipping. You can't get it anymore unless you are an already a subscriber or were a past subscriber. Sometimes they will open it up on Franco Shop if it doesn't sell out, and then I think it's like $35. So if you're interested in it, it might be on Franco Shop. And this box got a little beat up on the way here. You can see it's kind of punched in. Got a few tears in it. This is the solo box from the upcoming movie. I have seen a few spoilers, but overall I'm pretty excited about this box because I don't know anything about the movie. So we're still in that anticipation stage where you can be like, it's gonna be it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be it's gonna be great. And then you go see it and maybe it's not, but that's okay. Because it's all about the build-up man. <laughs> I hope it's good. I really do hope it's good. Alright, so there's nothing on top. So we've got this. You can see a hat. And it is Mud Trooper. I assume that is what it says in basic on here. Got the little Star Wars Small Bit Bounty logo. And on the bottom, the Pop and Star Wars logos. Very cool. It's a snapback. It says Mud Trooper on the back. Got a little Star Wars tag there. And inside you've got your little ribbon. It's pretty cool. So. Need to uh, bend the brim a little bit. But it looks pretty cool. I like it. Nice color. Nice color. Very practical color. I like it. Alright, so next thing. Yes, I'm going to leave the hat on is this little blaster keychain. Looks very cool. It looks like a Stormtrooper blaster. It's just flexible plastic. But that's pretty cool. Blaster keychain. We have a pin. That's pretty cool. I like the pins as opposed to the patches just because a pin I can do something with and the patch I'm not always sure what to do with. But this is the guy, he's either called Enfy's Nest or he's Enfy and he has a nest or he's from Enfy's Nest. I don't really know. But he's got a really cool freaking helmet. So, yeah. We have this guy. There's only one choice. Mystery Mini with one one choice. Got a little Smuggler's Bounty label right there. Not too much glue, I like that, so you don't get it too bendy. It is a collector's piece after all. And again, with the um, black bag. Really? I, I, I like the sentiment, but really. Alright, so we have the Lando Mystery Mini. This is him in the yellow shirt with the red tie and the white cape and shoes. I believe there is a regular uh, Lando with his like blue cape or whatever. Uh, 
and so this is like the Hot Topic exclusive version of that pop, but it's Smuggler's Bounty exclusive version of the Mystery Mini. I'm apparently really confused today. I don't have much to say about these characters because, I mean, it's Lando, right? Yeah, I know it's Lando, but I don't know how he's going to be portrayed by Donald Glover in the movie, and I don't know anything really about this movie. I've been trying to really avoid spoilers for the most part, so because I find these Star Wars movies are like, are way more enjoyable when you don't know what's going on in them. So I really appreciate that this is Lando. I think he's got a really cool sculpt and he kind of looks like he's in a disco pose, which is very cool. But again, I can't really tell you anything else about him. So other than he looks pretty cool. Last thing we have. Pop 2 pack. Han Solo and Chewbacca. They are dirty and chained at the ankle. So something nasty happened there. That's too bad. But they look funny. And they do have the little um last Jedi background in here, which I'm not really sure why, but. Funko seems to have that issue with their packaging. They can't decide which backgrounds they want to use. They just know they have to use a background. We got these two guys looking really neat. We've got Han all looking all dirty. Looks like he is in some kind of military uniform. He's got stuff on the back there. And then we've got Chewbacca. He does not have his bandolier. And he's looking a bit disheveled here. And just really, it's it's sad Chewbacca. Sad Chewbacca. It's really cool. This is like a new kind of like stand for them. It's like double stand here. So you've got the little chain right there. And so I, you probably wouldn't want to take these off even if, I don't think you can take these off, but even if you could, you probably wouldn't want to because you'd probably like end up breaking this final piece right here. Of course they're bobbleheads. Blue. It's looking like they're in jail together and that's how they meet, I'm guessing, from what I've seen of the previews. But uh, again, I don't, I'm trying to avoid too many spoilers so I really can't say much about these other than that they're chained at the ankle, they look dirty and sad, and yeah. You wouldn't know it from this video but I actually am really excited for this movie. So that is the Smuggler's Bounty for May. Pretty cool box. Looking forward to the movie. I think I've said that about a hundred times. But what else can you say about it? Because it's kind of a divisive thing amongst Star Wars fans. And you can say you're looking forward to it and people be like, no, 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 no. And then you can say you think it's going to suck and I think that's just really negative and I don't want to be negative about it, but I just want to enjoy my Star Wars. That's all I really want. Again, don't forget to check out my Star Wars Day giveaway video on my page. To enter, you have to be a subscriber and follow the rules that I've put in the description box. Thank you to those who have already entered. I can't wait to see who gets to win this little prize pack that I've put together. Thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a comment down below if you got this box and what your favorite item was. Or say something about what you feel about the solo movie. And thank you for watching. I will see you in the next video, guys. Bye.